Welcome back students, hope you all are done with your preparation for your exams, whereas I am going to give you certain important questions as per the request of few students texted me on YouTube related to the course mobile application as well as development under j 2 h R18 as well as R16 regulation. I have covered only few questions as you have in less time to work out this. Please do concentrate on the part which I am going to let you know in this video and do not skip this and do watch it and share with your friends. The first and foremost gunshot short question I can give you is the Android OS design features as well as applications and the types may be one of the question. Dear students do not expect direct question from this course you can expect 7 8 combination or 10 5 combination later installing versus running applications on Android studio as well as SDK features later Android programming best practices and its tools need to be explained and the resources for the devices and languages and language from this part you may be getting one a as well as 1b. I can expect this question as well as this best practices may be also one of the very important question. Later Android application life cycle is also one of the gunshot question which we can expect in the second part. Later applications application components of Android and Android development framework may be also one of the gunshot question. From this part we can expect second question I mean 2a as well as 2b. Later I have taken into consideration unit 2 also and unit 2 is also very large in its structure. Please do work out each and every parameter which I am going to highlight here. Android user interfaces, later the devices and the pixel density independent, independent measuring unit is oh, one of the gunshot question which we can expect and the different types of layouts and there may be the differences among their layouts. Later the differences between ed editable uh, as well as non-editable text views and even handling clicks as well as what are the different changes of various UI components may be also one of the gunshot question. From this part we will be getting 3A as well as 3B dear students. Please do concentrate on each and every part which I am highlighting here. Later explain in detail the life cycle of the fragments and what are the different types of fragment states may be also one of the gunshot question. Later I have taken into consideration the differences between adding as well as removing fragments as well as interfacing between the fragments and activities may be also the B question. From these two parts we will be getting 4A as well as 4B dear students. As the course is too lengthy in its structure as many students were requesting to work out this course important concepts. So, I have come up with the syllabus and I have put on the paper so that you work out accordingly so that this might be uh, one of the scoring subject later the differences between intents versus broadcasting and implicit as well as explicit related to the implicit we can expect equation for this time later using intent to dial a number or to send a message may be also one of the very important question finding and using intents received within an activity resolving intent filters may be also one of the five mark question so from this part we can expect the fifth question later what is the differences between the creating as well as dis displaying notifications may be also one of the gunshot question and the displaying toast and explain may be a 7 mark question if it is asked. This is a part where you are going to get 30 marks from this and 30 marks from this as well as 30 marks from this. Till here I have covered uh, I mean uh, 60 marks paper sorry the 90 mark later what is the shared preference and explain the creating and the saving and retrieving data. This may be one of the gunshot question where you are going to get one question from the part which I am going to talk now files and the specific folder applications and creating shared versus directing shared preference differences. I hope you are taking your exam so neat by using two set of pens and all the diagrams or the uh, the flow charts and the algorithms might be have done with the pencil. Do follow the same even for this course. What is reading data and the creating files explain in detail. From this part you may be getting one question dear students. Later the gunshot question may be the, the explain the SQLite database may be the last question from this you will be getting A as well as B and explain the registering content as well as providers with respect to insert, delete, update and retrieve may be a 5 mark question. Later explain the creating tables and opening a database. These all are the very important questions dear students which I have taken into consideration. Hope you are liking my videos and do subscribe to my channel and if you are looking for any other course please do comment and share this video to your friends which may help them. Wishing you a good luck and God bless you all. Thank you.